Hey, Christian Caveman back here. And I just wanted to do a little quick video on uh, the disassembly and reassembly of the Ruger P89. Little tank of a gun. Uh, first of all, check to make sure it's clear, empty, and do a little check there on the ramp. Nothing in there. All right, we'll drop the magazine. Nothing in. Double check here. Okay, and then in this situation, I like to hold it. Don't pull this back. But your ejector arm is right there. You can see that little deal sticking out. You got to push that down. Just push it down like that. And then I like to hold onto the whole gun just like this on your slide and then there's a pin right back here and just be ready and just kind of squeeze up and back and you seen that click down and then you got to find the sweet spot there and then that'll pop out you see that pull it straight back and then just slowly let that down the slide comes right off pretty easy cheesy here and then you can do some touch up clean up unless you have to do work in there but other than that you just set that aside and then if you want to break it down any further you just pull back on your spring and your plunger here and hold this just pull it back just a little bit hold on to it just because it's going to spring a little bit there you go and then you can pull this straight out Bring and plunger and set that aside. Let me move this stuff over a little bit. And then the barrel, it just kind of kicks up and out. Just like that. And pay attention to this right there, that little knob. That's where your plunger deal's got to go, right there. Little nipple on the end. So basically, clean up, do what you want to, get the carbon out, and then it's pretty simple to put back together as well. You get your barrel down into place. Kind of like reverse engineering here. You get that spring up into this tubular shape here, and then get that back on to that little pin there. See how that looks? And then you're good to go on that. Now, you just bring it back over. Slide this back on. And make sure this, your pin's all the way out. Sometimes it gets tapped and moved. And real quick, before I get that back on, you got, you're, you're cleaning in here, just kind of getting the carbon cleaned up. Make sure this ejector arm is still down. Because sometimes it'll pop up if you're messing around with it. See how that's sitting up? Make sure that's pushed back in or you'll bend it. And then it won't eject. It causes problems. So you got to make sure that's down before you put the slide back on. And then bring the slide back on. And the reason I'm doing it this direction is because this is how I hold it when I'm putting it on. So you can see. Bring it back into place. That wherever that pin starts going in, and there's a little notch on the end here, just like that. Now it's all the way in, and then rack it back, make sure it's there. You go, everything's working. Empty, of course. And then you got your decocker here. And that's about it. Disassemble, reassemble for cleaning purposes or working on the interns. Uh, it's uh, pretty simple. Take out the magazine. Lock back. Double check for safety with a little finger sweep. Bring down your ejector arm, just push it down right there, 
hold on to it like this push that back just a hair and the pin will slide out a little grab your plunger and plunger spring pop it out barrel out barrel goes back in get that spring from catching and make sure that's down into the right situation you gotta get it on that little dimple there bring this back into where those two holes line up so this pin will go in there just work it slide it a little bit and then back it back make sure everything's running and you're ready to go to the range with your tank. <laughs> Decock it down, which is a safety mode. It doesn't fire when you do that, when it's loaded even. It's just a safety mode. Now you're going into single double action here. Now you got your double action. See, nothing in it. Or you can bring it back. But something in there. You want to be safe, just push down your decocker, decocks without firing, releases that hammer, and that's it. That's the P89, Ruger P89, disassemble, reassemble. Uh, hope this helps people that might need a little help uh, figuring it out. It's uh, pretty simplex, uh, kind of a beast of a gun, a tank here. Uh, that's it. Uh, hope you like, uh, subscribe, hit that like button, appreciate it. Christian Caveman out. Have a good day.